Hi, my name's Lindsay and I'm going to show you the Elise induction range cooker. The Elise has got five induction zones on the hob. It also has a glide out grill, a multifunction oven, a fanned oven and a storage drawer. The Elise is available in a variety of colours to complement all kitchen styles. To ensure excellent cooking performance on induction, it's really important to use the correct pan and the right size pan for the zone. Rangemaster have developed a range of cookware that's suitable for all Rangemaster induction hobs. The Rangemaster stainless steel saucepan set is fantastic. It's got a really great ergonomic handle and crucially for induction, it has a really smooth base. When using a pan on induction, you must ensure the base is completely flat. So no spots, no circles, just flat across the whole base of the pan. Rangemaster saucepans are suitable for all hob types. They're oven safe up to 240 degrees and they're also dishwasher safe. The next generation induction hob features a bridging zone. This can be used for two pans as shown here, or we can remove these pans and bridge the zone to use the griddle. And the griddle sits on the zone like this. In order to bridge the zone, we need to use two control dials. So we turn the control dials round to power level nine and then hold them both together to get the bridge zone symbol. Then we turn the left dial down to the level that we're going to cook at. In this case, it's going to be level seven. The griddle has a non-stick cooking surface and it's perfect for vegetables, fish, steak, or garlic bread. The induction hob has a range of heat settings. The first three are temperature settings. L1 is 40 degrees, L2 is 74 degrees, and L3 is 94 degrees. An example of something that could be cooked on L1 would be to melt chocolate directly in the pan. For L2, hot holding, such as a curry or chili, and for L3, a rapid boil such as pasta or rice. In addition to the temperature settings, the induction hob has nine levels of power. An example of something you could cook on level three would be to very gently simmer something like a bolognese or chili. Level eight could be used to cook a caramel at a rapid boil. The induction hob is really versatile and can be used for any culinary task. It's also really easy to clean. Simply wipe with a damp cloth. The Elise has a deluxe glide out grill. The grill is on telescopic runners, so it's really easy to pull forwards. The tray and trivet are dishwasher safe and can be easily removed like this. The trivet has four height settings. This is the highest. We can turn it around like this to go a little bit lower, like this to go to the lowest setting and like this for a little bit higher. The grill has three heat settings, low, medium and high. You can cook using the full width of the grill or just the right hand half. When using the glide out grill, it's always open door grilling. The Elise has a multifunction oven. This means there are seven functions in the left hand cavity. We're going to use the fan assisted function. This function uses an element in the top and bottom of the oven and the fan assists the cooking process. To set the fan assisted function, we turn the dial to the fan assisted setting and then we need to set the temperature. 
The multifunction oven has our unique handy rack. This is perfect for roasting meat, or it could also be used to cook a lasagna or shepherd's pie, for example. The handy rack has two height settings, lower and higher. The trivet is enamel coated, so it's really robust, and it's also dishwasher safe. The right hand side of the Elise has a fanned oven. A fanned oven means it's the same temperature throughout the cavity, so it doesn't matter where you position the food. We're going to make some muffins and cookies, and I'm going to cook these on 190 degrees. The fourth cavity on the Elise is a storage drawer. This can be used for storing pots and pans and baking trays. The Elise is a really versatile range cooker. You can bake, boil, roast, griddle and grill all on the one appliance. For more information, visit the Range Master website.